Hello, welcome to my channel. And in this video, I am actually going to go through a search, a Google Search Console if you have a website and you do not uh, know about this tool, I am going to hopefully help you figure this out. Now, this video is actually going to be very useful, particularly for those people that already have websites uh, that have been old, right? Like websites that have been um, in operation for maybe a couple of years. Because what happens is that as our websites um, grow, we'll add more content and we don't always clean up the content. And so people may be landing on a page that has outdated information. And for example, I have a website that has, I think like 600 pages long. And um, this is uh, one of, from one of my businesses. And actually it says 245, but I know there's like 600, there's a bunch of pages that are not indexed. That's a whole different video. But right now what I want to look at is I want to look at performance. And then I want to look at the pages that are hitting, you know, that are getting the most traffic for Google, right? So when I come here and I look at the page, these are the different pages that are pulling in for that query, which is $99 divorce in Florida. So what I did is that I'm going to just, like, these are like very little, these are just impressions. These are just not that, but, um, so this one, this is the main page. I know that's fine. This is the one that I'm going to worry about right now. Um, and what I did is that when I went into the page, I actually found a lot of content that was not good. For example, there were some, uh, things here that were not, uh, some old, uh, buttons that were not good. It also went into a contact form, which I actually, for this particular website, for many websites, I do always, you know, get a contact form on the page, but, um, what for my business, because of how many inquiries we were getting and it was getting overwhelmed and that, mean, that meant I would have needed to hire someone. What I did is that automated the process so that people just go into a form, put in their information, answer three questions. And then I have in Zapier, uh, you know, an email going out based on the answers. So out of the three questions combined, it's nine potential answers. So they already get an email and a text message. Um, a text message is letting them know, hey, go check your email, check your spam folder. And then the, the email will address their particular situation, will give them the quote and how to get started with us. So it, and then I have a follow up emails after that, just giving them a little bit more information, trying to push them over the edge. And, you know, so I automated a lot of that. So I barely get phone calls anymore. I used to be bombarded with phone calls of people trying to, you know, get stuff done, like, you know, just trying to find out more information, all that. And it was just a time waster when we could all do that through email. Um, so, and of course they can still call us, whatever. So the keyword, of course, it, that is pulling is $99 divorce in Florida. We're not, we don't do 99 divorces dollars. At one point I did market that and um, most people, when I would talk to them, they wouldn't want that. They would want the whole thing because 99 was just typing. And most people were like, wait, wait, but, you know, so what's the difference? I'm, you know, we charge more, but this is like the whole Apple cart. And people always wanted the whole Apple cart. So I just did away with that, but I'm still ranking for that word. So I do want to have it in here. You know, companies offering are only, you know, so that it does come up. I don't want it to be removed. But I do definitely want to um, just change up, you know, add more content and whatnot. Another thing that I noticed was that the description was terrible. It didn't even have, and cost, I don't even know how this ranked, to be honest. Um, but, you know, I know that it did probably because I did have this word um, on here. And so I need to figure out how to put it here, but without indicating that we are going to do that for them because the old content and I should have, I pressed record after I started making the changes, but, um, so that's what we're going to do. So I'm going to do that. And, but my point with this video is to show you that if you have a website, you definitely want to look at, 
uh, Google Search Console, go into performance and look at the pages that are people are hitting and see if there's anything you can do to improve the um, the not the actual people either requesting information, contacting you, getting a quote, make, picking up the phone, whatever it is that you want them to do, whatever CTA. So my CTA, like I said, uh, you know, the, 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 what I want them to do is to get a quote, right? So I have two different versions of the same button. And so there's one on top and one down here. Um, so that's pretty much what I do. All right, so that said, I also will probably do a video added to this. It's something that I didn't do in the beginning. Now I do a lot more on uh, new pages, always have a video. And, um, you know, videos are super easy to do. It's either I mean recording my voice or I'll do um, a little slideshow almost thing with Lumen 5. Easy. Takes me 10 minutes. <laughs> so, yeah, so that's this is it. Um, I hope this helps. Uh, let me know down in the comments down below if you found information um, when you went through this view. Did you find web pages that you realized, oh, shoot, I need to change that. This is a good opportunity, you know, to do that. Like this, I added this. This is going to, I know this is going to be great because it's going to have right there, get a quote right on there. Um, you know, and then another one at the bottom, and I'm going to add a video somewhere. And uh, yeah, I hope this helps. Let me know if you found anything with this. That if you if you went to Google Google Search Console and you you found anything that um, that helps. Okay, all right. And don't forget, masterclass uh, is going on right now for free. You'll get a whole overview of SEO if you're a small business owner, been wanting to get more traffic from Google. This is definitely the masterclass for you. And um, I'll see you on the next video. Thank you. Bye.